Tonight's carnival food and games are on the minds of those planning to attend the Bloomsburg Fire Department's annual carnival that's underway. 2822 Eyewitness News reporter Sydney Costas spoke to fire officials about how the event helps them raise money for new gear and recruit volunteers. Carnivals bring out the kid in everyone, from the games to the food. Pennsylvania Dutch taco, it has mashed potatoes topped with roasted chicken with homemade gravy. And rides. You can find it all here at the Bloomsburg Fire Department's annual carnival. The carnival is a major fundraiser for the fire department. It helps us put firefighters in the trucks to come to your emergencies that we have to handle, and it also helps keep our property going and updating. The event has been going on for more than a decade, helping the local volunteer department purchase new firefighter equipment that costs upwards of $17,000. But it's not just fundraising that the department needs. They are also struggling to fill all volunteer positions. A shortage fire companies across the nation are facing. There's spots that we can take all the help we can get. If you don't want to be a firefighter, that's fine. Think about joining and become a social member. Help out with taking care of the place. So whether you're stopping by to try a tasty treat or test your luck for a prize, the show will go on at the fire station no matter the hurdle. The weather may be up and down, but that's not stopping this carnival and its merry-go-round. Friday and Saturday looks like good weather, and we're hoping it's like shoulder to shoulder. People here to enjoy the music, enjoy our car show, and just enjoy seeing each other and helping us out to meet our needs. In Bloomsburg, Sydney Costas, 2822 Eyewitness News. And the carnival reopens tonight at 5 p.m., and then it goes through Saturday.